Welcome back to school, guys. Back to school reactions. Back by popular demand with Upchurch. I don't know. I gotta remember to flip my camera so I point. Whatever. It's opposite day. So, you guys, I'm back on the Upchurch kick, you guys. I've been uh, going through some stuff with a lot of shit talkers on YouTube and Facebook and decided, screw this. I'm gonna get back to my grind, do what I do. And uh, uh, y'all haters can be damned. I can care less about you. Uh, thank you to those uh, who who went in my video and 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 supported me through that my little rant about the idiots in the comment section. Uh, they're alive and well. I think there is must be a network of them. They probably text each other and say go shit on this guy's reactions next and whatever. Y'all y'all can kiss my butt. We got my roots coming up from up church, and I can't wait to hear this. So make sure you guys subscribe, hit the bell notification button, and chill out with me. Make sure you select all on that bell notification button. Okay? Here we go, you guys. My roots. Hey, what the? Okay. Okay. Ooh. Kind of like that. Got a little rock beat to it with the acoustic in there too. Nice. Right. Right there. The first words he comes out with. Can he paint a picture or what, dude? Like I didn't grow up with rooster pens and all that stuff and chicken cages all over. But he paints such a picture you could almost see it. Like, I grew up with, we were growing, we were raising birds, but we weren't raising chickens. We were raising ringneck doves and finches and quail, my grandparents did. So, you know, I, I, I can't relate to the chicken thing, but I can see the picture, and I automatically go back to the Avery in my backyard that my grandfather built so we could have all those birds. So, uh, back to it. Daddy in the backyard, chicken pens and rows of roosters, broken down, no voting parts. Running in the woods and past the time with all my dirty friends. Catching snakes and I still catch them now. It's in a different sense. Mm, they say I'm gonna yep. change with fame, but I don't think I changed a bit. I'm anti right. everything that has to do with settling now, bitch. Okay, let me see when this was made 2016. Yep, he stayed the same. Still ain't trying to sell out. Still wants to call people out for selling out. Yeah, he stayed the same. I don't think I changed a bit. I'm <coughs> anti everything that has to do with settling now, bitch. They want my rebel flag gone. They want my words cleaned up, but I ain't. Four years ago, he wrote this, and look at the climate right now. You got people running around telling fake stories that Congress just passed a law to ban the production and display of the of the Confederate flag anywhere, and it's a, it's a crime. Bullshit, 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 bullshit. This is the stuff that's being spread, uh, but I digress. Take my flag. I dare you. I dare you. But I ain't having all that shit, you know where I stand, son. Still out here in the woods with the rednecks, popping fucking wheelies, no helmet of new road. Bitch, guns in my closet make my room look like a bass pro. Still got a rebel flag above my band, that's my roots for show. That's my roots for show. That, that's my roots for show. Still got a rebel flag above my band, that's my roots for show. Southern made in Southern Okay, land. I don't have a rebel flag above my bed. I have, I have that above my bed, um, but uh, my rebel flag's in my backyard, my rebel flag's in my garage, what you gonna do about it, you ain't gonna do nothing, I respect your right to have your feelings, respect my right to have mine, we'll leave each other alone and be good neighbors, you cross that line, we got a problem. Still got a rebel flag above my bed. That's my roots for show. Southern made in southern race. Stuck off in my southern ways. I will never change. Oh, yeah. That's my roots for show. I came a long way. And I know I got a ways to go. But I want to walk on the red carpet with muddy boots. Like, I don't know. I'm supposed to dress up for the show. I didn't get that memo, bro. I showed up to the CMAs with animal blood. Uh. Right. 
as the, as the damn alarm, dude. That is classic, dude. Uh, we have a town right next to us. It's, well, whatever. It's that way to you, but it's that way to me. About five miles from here, right? Called San Juan Batista. Do they actually have an ordinance that you're not allowed to touch the chickens and the roosters out in the street? And, and they're just... That's the alarm clock, man. It's just like the whole city. It's just loud. It's the craziest thing, dude. It's an old mission town. The mission is still there, dude. It's San Juan Batista. It's crazy because it's right next to San Andreas Fault. And from the mission, while you're standing out on the mission lawn, you can look out and you can see where the fault shifted before. And there's a crack in the ground. Uh, it's pretty dope. Uh, but, uh, yeah. I know that sound of the rooster alarm clock for sure. You wanna be real? I was raised up in a big red barn. Deep in Tennessee on my grandpa's chicken farm. Waking up in the morning, white hackle as my damn alarm. Still white hackle is that damn alarm. Right? Yeah. See, and you shouldn't have to change. That's the thing. You know, the 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 current temperature of our country is like they want to eliminate everything that they disagree with. Well, pff, that's called one-sided. You can't see both sides when you only are like like this is the thing. You got to be in the middle to be able to see both sides. When you're so far to one extreme or the other that you can't even see the other side at all. That's a problem. So, all right, let's get back into it. So, I love this song, dude. I love this song. Uh, Dude, I got some more Upchurch coming, too. Uh, I want to complete albums uh, so that I can actually start listening to the CDs in my truck. Uh, uh, not just use playlists off my phone of songs that I've done. So I'm going to go through. Uh, i got a couple more I think I can do. Uh, we'll get some more out there for you guys. Um, if you... <laughs> this is a tall order. If you're really, 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 really bored and... Um, have a complete knowledge of all of Upchurch's music, you can go look through my list of over 180 reactions to Upchurch and uh, see what I'm missing um, and maybe look like in specific albums, for instance, and go, okay, well, off this album, what what is he missing? So I can find out what I still need to do. I used to have a notebook when I first started the channel and then my wife took the notebook and then gave it back and then I lost it and then the dog chewed on it and I got another one and then it was like the notebook's gone. So... Uh, uh, if you have a dog that chews, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but uh, I'm going to be doing some more up church. Uh, y'all, get in the comment section. Give me more things to react to. All right? Uh, much love and respect to all y'all. Uh, peace. Y'all have a good time this uh, this weekend and uh, this Father's Day weekend. Um, and uh, uh, make sure to, to bless a father in your life. Uh, you may not have your father around anymore. Like, my father's gone. My grandfather's gone. But... Uh, you know, there's I have an uncle who lives with me who's a father. I can bless him. I can do something with him. Uh, just, just remember, guys, enjoy this weekend and have fun. Stay safe. Peace, y'all.